It's been almost three years since the prosecution says Daniel Serafini and Samantha Scott plotted to kill Gary Spore and Wendy Wood. Our cameras were not allowed inside of this Placer County courtroom today, but the prosecution put forward tons of new evidence and new video surveillance putting together a timeline trying to get this case to a jury trial. Daniel Serafini and Samantha Scott, the two people accused in the murder and attempted murder of Serafini's in-laws, Gary Spohr and Wendy Wood, in Lake Tahoe back in June of 2021. After waiting six months in jail, they were in the courtroom today, listening on as their defense teams and the prosecution provided evidence to the court and questioned some Placer County Sheriff's deputies who investigated the scene almost three years ago. Our cameras were not allowed in the courtroom today, but the Placer County DA's office showing some brand new, never before seen surveillance video leading up to this video, which we have seen in years past of the suspect jogging up into the driveway of the Spore residence. The DA's office believes this is Daniel Serafini, the suspect in this murder case. New surveillance video also showing who Placer County Sheriff's deputies believe is Samantha Scott driving a tan Subaru and dropping off Daniel Serafini near the Sunnyside Restaurant and Lodge off West Lake Boulevard in Tahoe City. Then minutes later, other surveillance video showing him walking down Westlake Boulevard toward the Spore residence. The day in court ended as the prosecution was showing phone records from Serafini and Scott from their Verizon and AT&T accounts. We are expecting to hear more from the prosecution and defense tomorrow. Now back out here live, the victims in this case, Wendy Wood and Gary Spore, are Serafini's in-laws. Daniel Serafini is the defendant. We are expected to hear from the victim's daughter, who is Serafini's wife, on the witness stand tomorrow. Of course, we will be back in court here, reporting live in Placer County, covering local news that matters. I'm Zach Boetto, Fox 40 News.